Unwanted physical contact can be distressing. If a person is the victim of unwanted physical contact, he or she may be able to pursue legal recourse through a tort action. In Snyder v. Turk, we explore the required elements for the tort of battery. Surgeon Robert Turk performed a gallbladder removal with the assistance of scrub nurse Barbara Snyder and various other medical professionals. During the procedure, Turk asked Snyder to pass him a clamp. When Snyder passed a short clamp rather than a long one, Turk became frustrated. He grabbed Snyder's shoulder and forced her from a standing position to a right angle with her face mere inches from the patient's open surgical wound. Turk then yelled at Snyder, stating that a long surgical clamp was obviously required for working in the wound. Although not physically injured by Turk's conduct, Snyder was scared and humiliated. Snyder filed suit against Turk, alleging, among other things, that Turk committed the tort of battery. At the close of Snyder's evidence, Turk moved for a directed verdict. He argued that because Snyder's evidence didn't show that Turk intended to cause personal injury, the evidence was insufficient to support a battery claim and the trial court should therefore find in Turk's favor without submitting the claim for jury consideration. The trial court granted the directed verdict in Turk's favor and Snyder appealed to the Ohio Court of Appeals.